Hey there, in this Excel tutorial, we are going to learn edit function. Edit function returns a date that is number of months before or after a specified date. This is the specified date and we want to find out what is the date after 2 months. So we will use edate function. Edate start date comma months. So start date is this. Months are 2 months and press enter and you can see that after two months from 23rd april 23rd june is the date all right if you want date in the past that is two month before 23rd april then you can use this function like this that is minus two okay you can type directly inside the function or you can use the cell reference okay start date is this comma minus two so the date is 23rd February. Now what if you want to find out what is the date after 5 years, 2 years, 10 years. Okay. So you can use this function like this. Equal to edate. And then start date is this. Comma. 12 multiplied by. So how many years you want? 5 years. Let's say 5 years. So 12 into 5 is 60 months. That is 5 years. Press enter and you will get a date that is 5 years after 1st January 2021 that is 1st January 2026. Now pay attention what this function does when we give a date after 2 months but that date doesn't exist. So what will this function do? So let's understand this example 31st May 2021 I want 1 month after this so that is you will think it will return 31st june but no it will return 30 june because 31st june doesn't exist so this function detects and understands the end of the month so it will adjust the date accordingly similarly you can see that two months back from 30 april you will think that it will return 30 February but no it will return 28th February because this is the last date of the February month and there is no such date as 30 February you can use this function to calculate anniversary dates due dates expiry dates etc I hope you found this video helpful see you in the next video